Cape Coast for Yambo. Now on CNA, the 25th Telesale Ghana Music Awards train stops in Cape Coast with the biggest jam of the year, the TGMA Experience Concert. The matter chop hot. Assembly Diloto. Hey! Aye! This is obviously the biggest music award scheme in Ghana and whenever they mash up the place, everywhere scatter. This is the experience concert as far as the Ga Telesel Ghana Music Awards is concerned. And yes, they've already made the announcement of the nominees of where Stoneboy and Kim Promise are said to be leading when it comes to conversations about who is going to win the Artist of the Year. In the new Artist of the Year category, Ken Paluta and Olive the Boy also stand tall in terms of conversation on the streets. But then, if you have any favorites, I'm sure you can point out who your favorite is as far as the Ghana Music Awards is concerned. This is Roland Report. If you're welcome, if this is your first time, don't forget to subscribe. Share this content with others so that they can also enjoy the beautiful things that you're enjoying on this platform. And you know this is a two-way street. So don't forget to also share your views in the comment section. Let me hear from you. Big shout outs to all the guys that have been talking to us on in the comment section. We really appreciate it. In fact, hey, when are they read the comments like that? They really feel you guys have no idea. Today I have another interesting one on the board, and it is about the experience concert. That is the Ghana Music Awards Experience Concert. Last year it happened in the Volta region where we saw some controversial performances where people said that Charlie, they ditched some of the home that is the local champions and brought exported artists from other regions just to come and entertain the fans but the organizers that is the charter house people also have different explanation to it this year it is going to cape coast yes cape coast is hosting this year's ghana music awards experience concert and they've already made announcement Proud to announcing the artists that will be built to perform. Yes, we also had the conversations that were ongoing, even with somebody like Kojo Viper, all complaining that they've not been called. But that, but that aside, they've made announcements, and this time it is Kenata and Stoneboy all headlining some of these concerts, as far as even some of the new laws in the unsung category. Let's go take a quick look. When we come back, we enter into the matter. Cape Coast for Yambo. Now on CNA, the 25th Telesel Ghana Music Awards train stops in Cape Coast with the biggest jam of the year, the TGMA Experience Concert. Oguaman, why you ready? Into the future jo Join the jam on Saturday, 11th of May, at the Robert Mentor Park and party with the big stars: Stone Boy, Kofi Kinata, Nasi, Amarado, Adina, All of the Boy, Kinpaluta, Guru, and the six and song artists all performing live. The party starts at 4 p.m. with games, food, drinks, DJ sets, and at 7 p.m. the big stage explodes live and also on TV3. Gates. Yeah, free! The 25th Telesel Ghana Music Awards Festival is powered by Charterhouse, supported by Guinness Ghana, TV3, our media partners, and sponsored by Telesel. Telesel, connecting energies. These are the lineups for the Telesel uh, Ghana Music Awards Experience Concert. So that will be happening on uh, that will be happening in Cape Coast. That is on the 11th of May 2024. I don't know what you think about the lineup, but in another conversation, I think people are so much concerned about how this is becoming, this is almost becoming a trend where the experience concert goes to a region and looks like some of the natives or the indigenous or the quote unquote, the people that we call the local champions are being left out. I don't know, but per the organizers explanation, they are saying that this is an experience concert whereby they would want to give that region a different experience because there are certain artists that obviously have not performed in those quarters before. So yes, they would even want to export some of these artists to the regions. But then there's also a huge concern of why they don't feature most of the on-ground artists. Because as far as this particular show is concerned, the only person that I can say is connecting from Cape to Takrade is Kofi Kenata. Aside that, none of these guys are ones that I can connect to. Because on Bill, you have Stoneboy, you have Kusi Ameruga, we have Nasi, we have Kempaluta, Olive the Boy, and Guru, all of them represented, as well as the people in the unsung category. 
I don't know what you think, but you can equally share your view. Let me hear from you in the comment section. Is there a cause for alarm when it comes to selection of artists for the experience concert? Or you think what the organizers are doing is the right thing? I mean, it is business. And whoever they choose to represent them on any of their platforms is their sole right. Let me hear from you. My name is Roland Amati. Until then, don't forget to stay safe. We'll meet you on the next episode. Peace. Bye-bye. Yeah, my dad job hot. Assembly Diloto. Hey! Aye! Hey!